And new tonight, we are getting to the bottom of an issue dividing our community. Use of force involving the men and women sworn to protect. And while some in our community are demanding changes, as Jacqueline Allen reports, they aren't convinced that leaders are going about it the right way. Hundreds of people rise up in this rally with harsh words for the Denver police chief. We are appalled. We're deeply disappointed. This after Chief White announced changes in the use of force policy, directing officers to slow down and adapt in volatile situations. But the changes came without community input, leaving those most affected by high profile cases of police force feeling excluded. We don't know what went into it. We don't know what it's replacing. We don't know who was advising on it. The community uh, is no longer waiting to be uh, invited to the table, but we're here tonight to build a table and we want to gather around it and get some stuff done. Family members of those affected by questionable use of force say the community is afraid. I might be the next to get murdered. What can we do? What are the answers? Chief White says reform is the answer. He's planning several community meetings to address his draft policy. People want reform. They're going to get reform. Now, some community members we talked to tonight say that's too little too late. Still, the chief stopped short of agreeing to a citizen's advisory board for use of force policy. He says he wants the entire community to be involved.